Man, as you know, we've been hearing rumors that Sammy the Smuggler is operating out of Alberta. Well, we now have intel on his scheme. It appears he's looking to gather diamonds from space. <gasps> That's right. He plans to smuggle them to Earth and undermine the diamond market. Are there really diamonds in space? Yes, Martin. As it turns out, the Spitzer Space Telescope is ideally designed to find them. There's no diamonds in space. Huh? I beg your pardon? You're a liar! I hate you! <laughs> ah, the news story's on Spitzer's website. You can read all about it there, look at artists, concepts, everything. The point is, we need to find Sammy now. I'm on the case, sir. dum de dum de dum 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 So you see, little Jimmy, there really are tiny diamonds called diamondoids in space. Jeepers, no fooling, Dad? Yes, scientists think they're surprisingly common out there. Would you like me to sing a song about it? Boy, would I? Oh, there are tiny diamonds in space that we call diamondoids, and they're 25,000 times smaller than a grain of sand. That's really small, but there are a lot of them. Ed Spitzer is well suited to find them at infrared wavelengths such as 3.4 to 3.5 microns. Good night, little Jimmy. Good night, Dad. I guess that space diamond smuggler isn't going to find himself. You know, son, I've heard that in just a single gram of dust and gas in a cosmic cloud, there can be as many as 10,000 trillion nano diamonds. That's good information if someone quizzes me. Uh huh. Can you take the trash on your way out? Duty waits for no man. It's too heavy for me. Oh, never mind. Diamonds are a girl's best friend. I wonder if I still have the artist concept of those diamondoids. Let me see here. Ah, yes. Those Spitzer people do good work. Come on, sugar cube. Let's ride. This is the last house on the block. If Can't he isn't here, I... I'm going to Hang on. When I get my hands on those diamonds. And no one can stop me. Especially not that do-gooder Mouncy Martin. And his meddling dog, too. Ruh-ro. Yes, sir. I'd sure like to see someone stop me now. <laughs> Mouncy Martin! Will you come along peacefully, Sammy? Or will I have to apply pressure and turn up the heat? You mean like the pressure and heat that forms space diamonds? Actually, that's not quite accurate. Heat and pressure form diamonds on Earth, but in space, the process is quite different. No kidding. Yes, these space diamonds are found in temperatures of minus 400 degrees Fahrenheit, and the pressure is billions of times lower than where diamonds form on Earth. Uh. Your cosmic crime spree is over, Sammy. So then I stop Sammy the Smuggler from stealing diamonds. Yes, I know. But they were diamonds in space. You told me all this on the way over, remember? And I rode my horse Sugar Cube <laughs> back uh -huh. to headquarters. Well, I, and I talked uh, to the chief mm, and he said mm, I did a really good job. Uh, and he gave me the ding. Uh,